Now it turns out that an influential columnist for the Washington Post who helped fan the name change fire has in fact changed his own mind. A recent Washington Post poll showed that 9 out of 10 Native Americans don't object to the name Redskins. Some of them actually like it. Robert McCartney, the Post's senior regional correspondent, editorialized for a name change for a year. Now he stopped. McCartney changed his position. He was a guest of Dennis Prager. How do you react now to the ones who were angry at you from the left, not the right? Well, the I under first of all, let me just make clear one thing. I still, you know, and I'm, I'm personally uncomfortable with the word, with the team name. Um, you know, I'm a big fan of the team. I mean, I'm a long time devoted fan, season ticket holder, you know, enthusiastic fan. But uh, I I was in a minority uh, of fans who thought the name should be changed before. Now I still don't really like it, but I have to say, in light of this poll, that I can't oppose it anymore. I mean, I think they they have, you know, there's no justification. I have no intellectual justification anymore for opposing it. Now the people who are mad at me from the left, they're basically making two, or well, I guess three arguments. One argument is um, the word is innately racist. Uh, the word redskin is innately racist, and you just can't get away from that. Um, I think that the poll shows, you know, where, where eight, four out of five Native Americans said they did not consider the word to be disrespectful of Native Americans. I think that the poll casts a lot of doubt on that. I know dictionaries, I used to cite dictionaries as saying it was, in defining it as a usually or often a racial slur. Uh, now I think the dictionaries are either out of date or incomplete. At least they need to be revisited. A uh, second argument that's being used a lot, and this is what a lot of the Native American activists are pushing, is the poll's methodology is wrong. You know, you don't like the results of the poll, so you question its methodology. Well, I just disagree with them about that. I mean, I have a lot of confidence in our pollsters. They were very careful to try to avoid the pitfalls that arise when you try to do opinion surveys of Native Americans who are a particularly difficult group to survey. But the poll had exactly the same result, as I'm sure you know, exactly yes, the same exactly. result I was going to say. 12 years ago. Right, the Pew so, poll, right. So I think we, not the Annenberg Center poll of 12 years ago. So, you know, I think we've now got two polls that basically, right. not just one poll, it's two polls over 12 years that show the same thing. And the second poll, our poll, in which, of course, I naturally, as a Washington Post person, have, have particularly great faith, um, the second poll comes, you know, after, you know, several years of very high-profile debate and discussion of this issue. 